Converting our natural resources to energy requires lots of raw materials. Whether our energy comes from the sun, wind, or from fossil fuels, the conversion process starts in the ground with minerals found in the Earth's crust. Sand, iron ore, and products derived from oil are used to make components like boilers, pumps, and pipes that help turn energy-dense fuels like coal, oil, natural gas, and uranium into affordable energy. Renewable energy uses similar raw materials to fossil fuel development, but requires more of them. We also have to build extra transmission lines and battery storage because wind and solar is intermittent. It also means that we need massive quantities of elements like silver, cobalt, and lithium, as well as rare earth metals like neodymium that must be mined from many other countries and transported across the ocean. Once these components are put to use building and maintaining power plants, they'll last a long time, but not forever. Most fossil fuel power plants, refineries, and factories last for about 60 to 80 years. However, renewable energy plants must be torn down or repowered within 20 to 25 years after they are built because they wear out more quickly. Recycling power plant components helps reduce costs. For example, the reuse of steel helps cut the need to mine additional iron ore. Many components from renewable energy plants, such as fiberglass wind turbine blades, are not recyclable and must be put in a landfill. As we consider building more wind turbines, solar panels, and batteries, we must account for the significant land and raw materials necessary to use them to help power our ever more interconnected lives.